next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the field. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish an opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight, but there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 157 pounds. Fighting out of Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, Chico. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, grip the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. situations normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success i want to see how this plays out well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman unable to land with that punch Landed the right hand there. Let's get busy with those hands now, man. Come on, let him go. Just a slip there. Oh, big head kick land. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. He blocks the punch. Uh. Caught that. 
no, there's danger in that too because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, here comes the high kick and you know, here's a lot of trouble. Back to the body lands for him. Good stick. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Just over three minutes now to go. Connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Oh, man. This is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head. Anymore. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't Stay see it coming. Hip over when he throws that kick. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Right hand upstairs. Right hand on point. Just misses with the right. Can't take many of those, you better check. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Ooh, head kick lands. Went for the inside leg kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chopping the wood with those leg kicks. Looking to land the leg kick now. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Checks the leg kick. What a punch. Watch knees to the body. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Nice slip to avoid the left. Big kick lands. Try to establish that jab. Ten seconds to go in the round. That shot blocked by Lee. Five minutes in the books. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, DC's back from the can as we get this next round underway, and his striking in that previous round was so good. I got tired just watching that. I mean, he did a great job of landing strikes, not only just punches. Not only just strikes, there were significant strikes. A lot of punches outside of the jab. I've gotten in trouble a lot of times about what's significant and what's not. Right. But I'm telling you, he landed a lot of punches that were very easy to make that determination. Leave the stack guys alone. Jim. Leave them alone, man. Over and over, I get in trouble. <laughs>
nice leg kick. There with a punch, so pretty good striking display by a muscle. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Able to check that kick as well. Right hand landed. Beautiful punch. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, and up taking the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Big leg kick land. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Throwing with authority. Oh, nice right hand. Lee's kick to the body. That one blocked by the defense. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Switching stances here. Straight punch land. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Trying to find a hole for that right hand. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. seconds. round is over and blood is just fauceting out of his cheek. That cheek has gotten out of control. Cut man can only do so much and given the fact that that cut continues to be attacked by the opponent, if this thing gets any worse, they're gonna stop this fight. All right, that horn marks the end of the round. There was a lot to like really on both sides, but particularly that Superman punch, an absolute thing of beauty. Beautiful attack, her ability to let loose in the octagon is truly a sight to behold. Not many people are willing 
to try Ready? something so risky. All right, next round is now underway. So Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of this fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. Yeah. He mixed it up. He went high when he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Real quick leg kick. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh, that is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed upright. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talk to your toughest. Oh, man, hate to be hit with one of those knees to the body. Misses again with a right punch. Way to hide that leg kick. Another shot lands upstairs. Lee gets hit with a kick. Turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. And he continues to work the body here. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising and it's only getting worse. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Oh. Not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, it's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was gonna be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. How about that shin? Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to working the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Sneaky head kick. Hook. That was a crippling shot right there. Do it real tight. Elbow tight. Big check in it. Landed it right on the chin. Great punch. Landed with so much power. Looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed as which he throws is crazy. Just missed with the left there. Oh, and he caught the kick. Looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Gotta be careful here, though, not to gas out. Big head kick! What a round.
This round. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the effort. in the night. Went for the inside leg kick. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. foot right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head. A lot of people. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. Let's focus now. Checks that leg kick. Good boy. Just over three minutes to go. Beautiful body kick land right under the elbow. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. hip into that kick. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body, and you gotta think his opponent is gonna continue to attack that area. Right punches there. Just over two minutes now to go. Oh, that's a nice strike. Punch is blocked. <laughs> Dig and kick. right there. And that one was heavy. Head kick. Round here, less than a minute to go. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. I'm trying to kick the leg out. He's really working over that lead leg with those beautiful leg kicks. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Oh, big punch land. Just misses there with the left. 
30 seconds now to go in the round. Clipped him with the right hand there. Big roundhouse now just misses. Ten seconds remaining in round four. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. Final round, you ready? You ready? Fifth and final round. Plus right hand is true. Big punch lands. Ooh. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Looking to land the right just out of range. How good is that right hand? Just unable to quite find that range. Beautiful body kick. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Big kick land. in a great performance by this young man. Well, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched one. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliante has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 56 seconds of round number five. Playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight he did exactly that. Congratulations.